address the young Indians, then they they uh, they claim that they are going to show black flags, but they try to attack the car. And the surprising thing is that when I come back at the same place, they again do the same thing. It means police did not take any action against them. Police did not ask them to go away from there. And yesterday, at three places, before the university, while going from Rajbhavan to airport, before the university, then in front of the gate of the university. And in fact, in front of the gate of the university, my feeling was that glass pane has been broken. They, the rods on which they had the black flags, they were using those rods to hit the cars. And just now, just now the pictures of the car are being taken and team has been called. The, the, if it were not a very high uh, quality car, it would, the glasses would have broken. There are so many scratches. It's a new car. So many scratches. Paint has been uh, is, is scratched. <coughs> so uh, then when this happened, j before the gate of the university, and then this is the scene. When this is the scene, then shall I run over over them? I, I ask my driver to run over them. They are standing in front of the car. How come police is allowing them? And another thing I tell you, they were transported into police vehicles or to all these places. When they were arrested, they were not taken by a bus. They were taken by the jeeps by which they were transported to these places. Who is the Home Minister? Who is the Home Minister? Chief Minister. Chief Minister. Everything is being done under his direction. It is he who has hatched this conspiracy and three days before these things have happened, he made a public statement. He said, Governor is provoking the students. He did not give the instance by what action I am provoking them. His students, his students are not only... I mean, they, it is not only the SFI, there are so many student organizations. Has any other student organization or student protested? So, this has been, this conspiracy has been hashed by the Chief Minister. He, it is he who is, at whose instructions these people are working. And I have already sent the message to the Chief Secretary and to the DGP that mere hauling up is not going to do. Indian Penal Code clearly provides Section 124 that if you try to overawe the governor, then that is a cognizable offence and has to be dealt with under Section 124 of IPC. I have already in the morning sent them, have told them clearly that simply hauling up will not do the thing. And as far as I am concerned, I have repeatedly said it. I am a student of his scriptures. Everybody knows. I am a student of his scriptures. Gita tells us, Yasman nod vijate loko, lokan nod vijate chaya, harsha marsh bhayo deger mukto, ya sa cha me pidiya. One who does not try to scare anybody, he is not scared of anybody. I do not try to scare anybody. There is no question that I shall be scared of anything. They are saying, why I got down from the car? Shall I keep sitting in the car and, be, and allow them to break the glass of the car, which will injure me? Sir, as so, this is being done repeatedly, as you are also pointing it out, so what is going to be the next course of action? You are going to meet the president. Next course? No, 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 no. I don't believe in complaining. The other reason possibly is because the chief secretary of the Kerala government in an affidavit before the High Court 
Kerala government is not in a position to pay the pensions of the employees. But in addition to that, he has said in the affidavit that government of Kerala is not in a position to honor the financial guarantees which it has given, which means financial emergency in this state. And I have asked for a report. Since then, they are totally... Have you ever heard any chief minister saying that government is not bound to reply to a, every query of the governor? Have you ever heard any chief minister? He is saying that after I ask for report, let him not reply. I will wait for 10 days. And then it is my duty, if the state is in crisis, it is my duty to make my recommendation to the central government. <coughs> the, that seems to be the, to be the main reason why they are feeling so picked. They themselves has, have said before the High Court, we are not in a position to honor the financial guarantees. Sir, yes. Sir, even if this must happen, the mild, uh, what we can say, the IPCs are imposed the ministry. The FIR also there. Hmm? The FIR. Very tight sections have been. So, so I'm, I have already told you, I have sent the message to the Chief Secretary and DGP that these sections will not do. They have done it with the head of the state and there is a clear cut provision in IPC. That is section 2124. Without that, it will be deemed that no action has been taken by them. Who is he to tell me? He wanted me to be injured while sitting in the car? They were trying to break the glass panes of the car? Who is the law minister? And sir, you are saying that this was pre-planned and scripted. This is pre-planned. And this conspiracy chief minister is responsible. And this is not the first time. In Kannur, when an, uh, they had tried to assault me physically, the man whom you can see in the video, he is preventing the police from taking action against those who are creating disturbance. Chief Minister appointed him as his secretary. He rewarded him. Sir, there are some uh, same protest against uh, Chief Minister. Sir. Oh, Governor and Chief Minister are not on the same standing. IPC provides provision for the President and Governor, not for the Chief Minister. And, and do you know, for throwing a chappal, what are the charges? What sections have been slapped? 308. And how brutally those people are being beaten inside the police stations? Do you, have you any idea? And here they are being taken, uh, even after the arrest, they are being taken in the same jeeps in which they were brought to these spots. Police jeep, uh, can it happen that the protesters will come sitting in, a, in police jeeps? Unless, unless Chief Minister, who is the Home Minister, is directing the whole thing? Is it possible? Sir, Kerala, it is the start of the collapse of constitutional machinery. Sir, are you satisfied in the protection which are arranged by the Kerala police? Sir? I do not. I have already told you, I am not the one who fears. Therefore, I do not look at no, what sir. kind. I am not, I am not going into that. I am ready to face any consequences. I know I cannot live longer than I am destined to live and I cannot die before the, my time has come.